Rise of Iron starts with Saladin sending us to secure Felwinter's Peak from the House of Devils, where we fight Sepix Perfected, who's somehow alive using an unknown technology. Sepix escapes and Saladin appears, telling us that the Fallen already know about Siva, so we need to stop them by heading to the Cosmodrome, where we learn that Siva is capable of creating anything, and that the Fallen have restarted its production process, using it to augment themselves, becoming Devil's Places, so we need to destroy the chamber where it's being produced. We also learn about how Rasputin used Siva against the Iron Lords, killing them by infecting the weapons and armor until Yolda sealed herself, the remaining Iron Lords, and Siva inside the replication chamber. We end up entering a Clovis Brave facility on Mars to find some info on Siva and discover a way to briefly disrupt the Splicer's control over it. So we use this new info to make it to the chamber, fight off the Siva infused corpses of some Iron Lords, and cause the chamber to self destruct. Saladin then recalls us to the temple and gives us a sword and the title of Iron Lord, which leads on to a raid against the leader of the Devil's Splicer's Axis, Archon Prime, bringing an end to Rise of Iron.